What's up everyone, welcome back to another video and this video I'm going to talk about how to fix the NVIDIA FPS drop and performance issue. So in this video I'm going to talk about how to fix this, so I'm going to quickly get into the step. So the first one is all about what we need to do is if you find the NVIDIA control panel here, you can open the NVIDIA control panel or right click on this one and go for show more options here. We will be getting the NVIDIA control panel over here or you can just search over here for the NVIDIA control panel like this and you can open the NVIDIA control panel. And once after it is successfully done, what we need to do is we just need to wait for this to get completely loaded up. Then you have to navigate to the manage 3D settings. And right now we need to go over here in the global settings and right now what we need to do is we just need to keep scrolling down and navigate to the first one if you find anything over here under the global settings name it shader cache size so if you scroll down you can see the shader case size this may actually be set into driver default so from here what we need to do is we just need to right click on this one we have options like this the first one try for disabled over here and once it's successfully disabled you have to go for apply and once the apply is successfully done, we just need to move to the next one. After the apply is successfully done, what we need to do is we just need to scroll this down and we have to move to the next one. That is all about just go over here, search for the NVIDIA app. Now from here or you can just go for the NVIDIA app over here. And what we need to do is we just need to go over here and go to the drivers and make sure what kind of driver is here. It's selected. So we have two options. Either you have to select the game ready driver, which means it is actually for the gaming, which is having high performance. Another one is for the studio driver which is for what you can try with the normal usages so after you select whatever your requirement is in my case i'm going to select the game ready driver and what we need to do is you have to download this one the geoforce game ready driver which is released on the version 572.83 you have to reinstall and download this now once after it's successfully done what we need to do is after it's successfully downloaded it is done you are fine with it afterwards you have to move to the next one just go over here search for the disk cleanup over here you can search for disk cleanup like this you can just click on this particular one and right now go for select the local disk what is yours and go for ok and now from here you can see we have to select one thing called direct x shader cache so select the direct x shader cache and once afterwards go for the cleanup system files so everything will be deleted and once afterwards it will be like completely deleting everything and once it's successfully deleted you have to close this and move to the next step next step is all about we just need to go back to the nvidia control panel after doing all these things and navigate to the shader cache size here and we need to change this one to the driver default one and you have to go for apply and once it's successfully done you are fine with it and this is what you have to do and you have to go for the apply and once it's successfully done just close this and that is fine so these are the steps and i hope this video is helpful and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notifications see you soon in the next video peace out bye bye